Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mkholi Singube. Uh, I'm here to respond to one question from ZEP applicants uh, who want to know uh, how they can get a, an online application form uh, which is one of the requirements for submission and they want to know because it's written that they must submit an, a field online application form but they don't know where and how they can get this do, uh, this particular document because they've been told that no handwritten forms will be uh, entertained. But before I go ahead, may I request that you subscribe to this channel, like this video and share it. So the question, this is not a question as such, but it's one of the requirements, one of the six requirements uh, that one has to fulfill upon their submission of their application uh, at the VFS office. So people want to know if there is a form that has to be filled online, which they can then submit. Yes, of course, there is a form, but what you have to do is you go online, you fill in your application uh, as per the prompts that are there, uh, whether you're applying for a visa or you're applying for a waiver, there is a form that you fill uh, and then you submit. Then after submission uh, online, you print out uh, a checklist. Then you print out a bank deposit slip. Then you go and deposit the money at the bank and the standard bank. Uh, after you've done this, what is going to happen is that your money is going to show on the application portal within 24 between within between 24 and 48 hours when it shows you then book your appointment you select the date which is most convenient to you but also available uh, on the vfs uh, portal then after you've booked that that is when you then also print out um forms that are there they will include a checklist again and the form that you filled previously when you first met the application will automatically uh, be available for printing that is the online application form which you need to then produce it's already filled as long as you have uh, paid it means that you filled the form because it is the particular form that you feel to apply in the first instance so after you have paid and you have made your appointment then you will print out a, a form that will go into your email or the email of the person that helped you fill the form you fill out i mean you print out the appointment form from the email and then the form that you filled in initially is the one that is called the online application form so there is no way where you have to download any particular form other than the form that you filled in when you first made your application that is the online application form so it's available automatically for print out after you have put your appointment i hope i make this clear uh, if it's not clear you are still free to reach out to me via the comment section underneath this video to ask the particular question or clarification where you didn't understand thank you very much Please subscribe to this channel, like this video and share it.